Well, hello there, my dear friends. Welcome back to the Scott Reed Project. And it's that time of year again. Spring has sprung and it brings with it the first foraging crop, the wonderful wild garlic. Now the lanes, the highways and the byways are bedecked in green, bejeweled in white of this fantastic free food. So the beauty of this beautiful wild garlic or ramps is one, it's free, two, it's not as pungent as normal garlic, but the best thing is you can use the entire plant. So these beautiful mild green leaves, these lovely white flowers, then later on, uh, you can dig down into the roots and they've got the tubers. You can also cook with that. So it's a win-win and we're gonna cook some here in this brook in England in Herefordshire. Not too shabby, eh? So here on the SRP then, we talk a lot about field to fork, about wild food, the wild harvest, and it doesn't get any more wild than this. So we're gonna be making a fantastic wild garlic omelette. Three ingredients done very, very well. And like all recipes, you need to go shopping so we're just going to pick some beautiful fresh green leaves and then it's over to the SRP kitchen. No expense spared. Look at that. So when I say no expense spared, I wasn't joking. Jamie and Gordon, eat your heart out. What we have here is the SRP Mark 1 field kitchen. Basically a pheasant feeder with the lid upside down on top of my barber jacket. Maybe it'll take off, maybe it won't. Anyway, first thing I'm gonna do then is to chop my garlic because I want this to happen really, really quickly. So you'll have to excuse the noise. You know, we're out in the middle of the country on this posh, posh range and I can't help it. There's people walking their dogs, people enjoying the weather and there's me, like a loon, stood by a brook, in a wood, chopping wild garlic. Right, a bit more. So next then, I wanna get my eggs ready. So I've got four lovely free range eggs. Now I'm using four, because my pan is slightly large for an omelette. You really want about a 28 centimeter pan for the ultimate omelette. So I'm just gonna crack these bad boys into this bowl. Look at this, got everything. So whiskey, whiskey, whisk worth, breaking up those yellows. And you wanna try and get a bit of height in it, get some air in it. And then as if by magic, in my front pocket, some salt on the deck. And in my back pocket, a touch of white pepper, hey. And then again, give it a good whisk up. And if you can see, if I slow it down, I'm lifting it quite high. Pattern on, one knob of butter. The local walkers. So my butter has browned nicely in with my egg. It's on a bit of a funky angle and it always the way. So I'm just going to do it till it sets around the edges. As you can see what I mean, you really need is a smaller pan, but we make do with what we got. Sprinkle in our wild garlic, just like that. Then what we do, my method, is you wait for it to set at the sides, push it in, push it in, and this gives you a lovely light and fluffy omelette. Push it in, push it in, and then you can travel the rest of the egg around the pan. But not bad for outdoors, eh? Wow. 
wild garlic omelette in the wild. So I'm just going to attempt to flip this behemoth just to try and get some kind of a decent shape. Remember I'm not in a kitchen, I'm in the wild so you have to excuse it and I'm just going to brown it gently on that little bit of heat there. Then we will turn it out onto our plate. One wild garlic omelette and just because we can let's just give it a bit of decoration. What more do you want man? Here we go, let's try a bit of this, I can't wait. Proper big mouthful for Scotty. Absolutely wonderful. Absolutely wonderful, cooked to perfection. Just have a look at that. How good does that look? That wild garlic in it, you can see how light and fluffy that egg is. Can you see that? So light. So fluffy, look at that, hey? Wouldn't you just eat that now? Mm. Just need a cup of tea. I've got to finish that. The taste of the garlic is just so delicate, but it makes such a difference. Well, there you go, my friends. My wild garlic omelette cooked in the wild. Free food, field to fork, wild harvest it don't get better than this so if you've enjoyed what you've seen here today click that subscribe button there my ugly mug i will put it up at the end also on my social media facebook scott re the scott re project and on twitter at the scott re project so until next time i'm just going to go over there sit down and chill out thanks for watching right, let's get this mic off oh what a beautiful morning